hey guys what's up and welcome back to spectrum and channel so today in this video i am going to show you how do you make a cool looking title in paint 3d software already included in your windows 10 yes you can just find it here by going to the search bar and type paint 3d and there it is so just open it okay so before starting i would like to tell you that my channel is all about 3d designing tutorial visual effects and visual effects short movies so if you are new to my channel make sure to subscribe and leave a like to this video okay so let's get started so press on the new okay so this is the interface of this pant 3d this is more common like the other common pant here you can see here you have common things such as pencil this is your screen here you can draw anything and uh, markers everything are available here you can increase the thickness just as there were okay so we will not draw on this we will draw on separate part that is in the 3d view you can zoom in and zoom out using the mouse wheel button okay and you can rotate your view by pressing the right mouse button and then turn and then move the mouse so you will just explore your scene and by pressing you just draw by pressing the left mouse button you draw whatever you have selected on the this white plane so what we will do is we don't want this because we will draw the text and that will be 3d this is what we are doing is all 2d so here come to canvas this place is called canvas and just show canvas so make it off we will type insert text so press on text and here select the 3d text and now just be like that here it's a common text box so just type the text i will type my channel name that's it and click outside and it's done we'll go back to 3d view so if i zoom in now i will just rotate around the object you can see it's 3d if you look from this side and then select that box rectangle that is appearing so just click and hold you will move in that axis if you rotate to this side you can see that box rectangle change to this view so now you can move in this other axis just like that if you look from top so now you can move in the bottom axis in the bottom plane okay so now what we'll do is i will scale this this text so just like common 3d object i have scaled it well, that's a little too much okay you can see i'm just moving it and now i can scale it on the other axis also just like that and you see here that's it so whatever you can type in there okay now you see here is the select so press on that and you can select this text okay so now if you want to change the color you can see here i will i think i will insert this this red one okay that's good here are some options for you if it is matte then it has no reflections you can see if it is uh, glossy so it has some reflection but not much if it is dull metal still it has not much reflections but if it is pol polished metal you can see it's it looks it shows more shininess shininess okay we will just move it down so it is touching this ground and okay so if you want to make this reflection visible so for that you will go to this menu and here there is settings okay and here you can see it just display quality so just make it ultra and maybe just do the settings what i have 
so you will have like this result now you can change the background color also for that you can come to effects and here you can see like this whatever you want it also changes the light color the light direction as you can see what it does is it moves the light around this object if I do this so the light is now behind the object there if I do this the light is now in front of this there you see okay so just whatever you like such as you can see there are many options this one is also gold or red so I will just select uh, which one okay this one finish so now you can see the light is in front of this text so I will make it to the side now you can see here these reflections these are appearing if I move this then they go away not go away but they move to other direction so I want them to be visible okay so that's it no you will now animate it okay so for that what I will do is go to menu and here it says save you will select video so this new window will appear here you can see you have many options how to save it mp4 video what will be the dimensions of the video so this will be the resolution more video settings frame rate I will select 60 it looks more better quality and here is the main part animation you cannot do manual animation you will just have to go with these few kind of animations you can see turntable the text is just rotating swing like that like that wobble emerge hover here you can increase the speed I will go back to normal number of loops how many times it will it will be animating okay but still that's not it here you can see you can change the adjust angle and framing okay so here in this window what we will do is you can change the camera properties this is the zooming of the camera from the view which are you viewing and if I press and hold on the mouse middle button I can move my camera so I will just center it out and now what is the resolution of your screen or what ratio you want the video to be so this one is better and you will position also your camera with the right mouse button I am rotating the camera press and hold and just move the mouse so the camera is rotating okay so I will just place it at like this okay now press ok hmm. okay so there you see I have selected this one emerging so you can see this is looking better you can change the text size or uh, text font style also but uh, you have got the point how will you make this so now what you will do is just click on the save button and you will just save it so then it will be saved and you can play it so that's it guys i hope you have learned from this tutorial so now you can make some cool looking impressive titles within your computer and no needing of any softwares so try it out and if you have any thoughts just leave in the comments i will reply you back and make sure to subscribe for more tutorials and the short movies that i make you can actually watch them i have so many in my channel i have given the link for the playlist in the description so subscribe and thanks for watching see you in the next video yeah.